Hi guys, I'm Exacaz and welcome back to another episode of Transport Fever 2. Okay, we are flying high above our areas here. Look at all the trains down there. Excellent. We're in the, I think this is the DC-3. Uh, I'm heading all the way down to Van Airport down there. Look at Genesis growing nicely over here. Look at those high, um, those high rises. Excellent. Really looking good. Really looking good. Excellent. As always, thank you so much for all your comments. Um, I think there's some good ideas coming out of Discord specifically over here. Um, we should add the strict emissions controls in uh, Kevinport, which is awesome. I think that's a brilliant idea. That's exactly the kind of um, themes and the roles that we want to do. So I think we're going to do do that and we're going to be very sure not to have too many emissions over there. Then we uh, maybe we should look into doing a bit of a bus hub. Um, specifically, this was a suggestion at Suncorp Crossing. Look at the, how we're coming in over the river here. That's really awesome. I do like this. Look at all the fish down there. My goodness, we should get into the fishing industry. Nice. Look at this. This arrival um, is really awesome. Okay. Um, the bus up at some Sun Gulf Crossing, maybe. So we'll we'll maybe see about doing a bus up there that um, provides bus access to some of the other towns that won't be on a main line or a branch line. The main line or a branch line. So yeah, that's an interesting idea. Uh, we're definitely not going to make that the end of the line, though. There's still a lot more map to go. Um, the, check all the blocks near the new station um, for the food. I think there, there might be an issue there. I did spot that there was a little bit of a delay there. So we'll, we can have a look at that. The airport looks pretty good. Nice. Look at all these people waiting for the plane. Don't create trains longer than the stations. Yes, that's something I don't, don't want to do. But any now and every now and again, it kind of happens. Well, these planes are close together. There's the other one coming in. Uh, we need them to space out a little bit more. Yeah, well, it looks quite cool. Um, and then more grain trains. Okay, that's something. In, uh, I think this was uh, near Maluchburg where that's required. Please do the Berlin airlift. Yeah, I think that's, uh, that's something we will get to. But I'm not sure we'll get to it in this episode, though. I mean, we need to uh, move a fair bit of freight to some of our airports if we want to do that. So uh, we will get into that and see how it goes. Wow, nice little takeoff over there. So let's get straight into it. There's a lot for us to do in this episode, and I want to get a fair bit done. Um, so first things first, I think over here... Because this is a single line, and I did add potentially more blocks in here in between episodes, but uh, because this is a single line, I think what I want to do is do a little bit of an extra section of, um, yeah, somewhere over here, a little extra section of rail, third rail that goes into there. So there's a bit of a waiting area for, for, for the guys here. So let's uh, grab some track, make sure that there's catenary on there. And what I want to do is I just want to slip it off maybe not quite there let's slip it off a little bit further away yeah something like this is okay uh, 100k slip off is, is fine and then we will wrap it around here maybe not all the way till there let's just wrap it around till about here and then the plan is to tie it in over here Okay, so something like this is now going to be, and this, yeah, so I would like us to just give this the, uh, so let's see, so we could probably do about two in here, so if we do one there and one all the way at the front here, maybe we can get, yeah, two of them in there, and what I don't want is for these guys to now, um, run on there I want to move it out this way so what I'm thinking let's pause the game for a second while we quickly fix this up I'm going to um, uh, delete that and I'm going to delete that section and then from here I'm just gonna run straight into that one mm -hmm. track from there straight or no 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 why are you not straight into there yeah that's the that's the that's the one that I'm looking for okay so presumably that will see us yes this is the plan now we'll get why of oh, that is that one okay the issue is this guy, 
Hmm. Can we run this one straight through here? The issue is there's a line that actually comes from here. Now I'm uh, I'm a little stuck on this. Let's uh, let's see. Can we can we do something like this? It's probably a little tight to get all of that to work. Yeah. So starting it over here might not have been the greatest idea then. So let's uh, let's trim it back. Let's uh, let's start it up here instead. Okay. So we'll do that. We will start it. Right over here, we'll try and get like a, a 80 off of here should be fine. That's okay. We'll tie that in there. And then what that means is we probably can't have this signal here. So let's uh, get rid of that signal there. And now if we look at it. Cool. Now we've got a little bit of a waiting area over here. We should have a signal there. Okay, that should be fine. I think I think that's going to be fine. That's going to help us out a little bit with uh, vehicles waiting over here. Here comes a train back from up there with some uh, lumber or logs or planks. Planks is what we're after here. So there we go. Okay, I'll speed things up so we continue to make money. Okay, let's have a look at um, that's what's going on. So this is Kevin Port over here. We want to reduce our emissions um, a lot. So currently we've got a bus running over here. So one of the first things that we're going to need to do is we are going to have to implement um, some electric trams to uh, to address our our emissions um, policies that's now been in place here. This is going to be a nice little um, port town on a lake of Kevinport. Um, so let's get our our um, <coughs> emission controls in place. So we'll grab this guy, we'll make sure that we get some electric tram track on there and we will then um, update our, uh, our, our little loop here. Oh, look at that one. What is that? A Bristol freighter? Hmm. Is that the kind of thing that we'll use for the, uh, for the airlift? <clears throat> I don't know. We'll have to have a look. Run that through there. Oh, we'll run this way. We'll run that way around here, down there, down there. Nice, all the way through here. Awesome. Can we tie in all of that? That is getting the electric trams. Um, and over there, that should be fine. That's going to be good, useful, tying all of that together. Nice. Okay. Now, what we need to do is we'll quickly replace all of these vehicles, manage um, vehicles on this one. <clears throat> oh, before we do that, of course. Oh, and it's going in both directions. Let's before we do that, we need another um, little depot over here. So let's get a tram depot. Um, I think not uh, out over here is probably about the right the right spot for us. So let's uh, let's turn that in and we'll place the tram depot in here. Let's get it uh, lined up with the road a little bit. Not bad. I like that spot right there for it. Okay, perfect. So now we'll uh, try this one more time. These vehicles manage the vehicles. Uh, we'll do all of them. And we'll say loan. No, um, replace the selected vehicles with. Uh, ooh, it does not want to let me. Does not want to let me do that. Okay, well, what we'll do is then let's just sell all of these vehicles. We'll get the others and we'll sell all of them as well. Uh, oh, actually not the line, the vehicles, manage the vehicles and we'll sell all of them. Excellent. There they go. Now we'll get some new vehicles in here. Buy vehicles, these ones, T1s. Let's do like uh, maybe five of them per side. So that's going to be kit one. And we'll do five more so that we uh, reduce our uh, emissions here. And that'll be kit two. There we go. So now hopefully that'll all <clears throat> start running again and we can significantly reduce the emissions that we've got going on over here. There should also be a, it's a nice little tranny feature for the town over here. Awesome. Awesome. Good stuff. Okay, where are we going to go to from there? There's some grain grain stuff over here. So maybe I'll do a little bit of work on this line to get our food stuff going on. Um, let's quickly have a look. Do we have towns nearby that can make use of a bus hub over here? 
maybe Apple be Westmoreland in Westmoreland over there can 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 connect over here with buses that would be pretty cool the main line will continue to Newton Abbott over here which will will get new names for them um, but also maybe we can connect buses for this wow that will be quite a significant um, run of road here and we may even have to kind of run a little bit of a tunnel through here or actually just kind of go around here that's probably um, better we'll go through there um, so yeah then we're going to get some bus bus lines, lines that runs into San Cal Crossing but first things first let me uh, extend the main line into our new town over here um, the renaming of this town will be it will be called Epicville Epicville okay EVE um, Epicville Eve and um, yeah, in, a, in, an <laughs> in an attempt to uh, to get another town on the line here. Immediately we see a skyscraper appearing due to me renaming the town. Excellent. I do like like that. Okay. What I'm going to do this time around, I'm going to split up the, the stations again. So we're going to do one on the one side, one on the other side. So where do we have... Yeah, unfortunately... Oh, no, no, no. Our, um, our uh, industrial stuff's over here. Oh, there goes the... Oh, it was collapsed for a, for a smaller one. Okay, now let's uh, let's grab this section. Let's get the building here. So what I'm going to do the freight one will go super long, um, probably four. Yeah, I'm quite comfortable with four like so. Uh, actually, let's just do one, and then I'll uh, I'll do it myself. So I'm gonna try and get. If we do something like this, this is actually not going to really work over here. So let's uh, trim back some of these guys. We'll uh, we'll get a little bit of a road going on here first. Um, no tram tracks or anything like that. Just keep what you've got and let's just uh, see about running this road up here a little bit. Like so, we'll get that one all connected. Uh, actually, I don't like it. It's not good. It's not good. What I'm going to do is I'm going to just uh, kind of trim it like uh, an edge here and we'll have the station up here. Up here. I, I, I like the idea of, of doing that. So let's uh, grab train buildings. Now let's um, see about lining that up quite nicely over here. There we go. I like that. Um, I'm going to trim this back so that we can get that around there. Yeah, that, that should should uh, should go nicely in here. Let's configure this. So I want to... Oh, we actually didn't have the right stuff in there. But anyway, I want to do... Yeah, I want to do it like this. Perfect. And we'll get the uh, cargo platform on the other side. <sighs> Every time. There is, without doubt, every time this kind of happens, I need to trim back one of them that kind of popped into the wrong spot. Uh, okay, I think that is it for us over here. Let's just make sure we actually upgrade the tracks a little bit to uh, include tannery and include high speed, actually, high speed. And now that should all be perfect. So that's going to be the um the the freight side of things and then what i'll do is i will i'm actually quite keen on doing a little something weird over here uh let's do let's get at the road um street st standard street we'll tie that one in there i'm gonna pause the game just for a second while we dip that one down this one i want to do like an underpass underneath the station and then we'll put the station in here so get the road and then if we say like actually guys I want this guy to go to go down wow it uh, takes a little bit of time to get there actually so I'm not sure this is gonna gonna work for us is it no this is kind of where we where we need to go in order to get down into a tunnel then we can put the station in here and then there'll be an underpass underneath it. Uh, no, I'm not going to do it. It's not going to. It's not going to work out. So let's just um, let's just trim these little sections off, and we'll put our station in here, and we'll see later how we how we deal with the rest of that. So again, 
240 stand uh, actually high speed is what I'm after that is the plan let's uh, move it around we'll get it to it is kind of the commercial district in here uh, actually not so much commercial if we do it up here over there it kind of feels like it's more natural on like the main street the connection here so let's uh, find it there we go that's the spot Epicville transfer I like it um, now let's uh, let's add some more again we'll do the same kind of arrangement here and have them the trains pass a rush through in the center good and we'll get some platforms this time around we should have them all done it excellent that helped that works let's uh, let's get some of these uh, where is the okay we'll slot one in there and we'll slot one in there and we'll slot one in there so it kind of looks a little bit more realistic I also want to give us um, some of these coverings nice little uh, platform going on right over there okay perfect so that's it I can unpause the game I didn't do do that much stuff okay let's get out of here game is running at full speed now let's uh, let's get the, the tracks extended so guys I might go into a very quick little time lapse where I quickly finish off the track um, for this section over here <laughs> and that's just been a very quick little one um so now we're back so i've kind of connected up um, um epicville over here and i'm kind of wondering about where the the line will go to from here is it going to go to dartmouth over here or are we going to uh try and come over here to needham um there's a lot for us to get to um up there in the north so i'm thinking maybe just up here but I'm, I don't want to be running next to the river all the time. I'd rather at some point actually tie, come in, in. So maybe what I'll do is I will actually run up uh, here to Malden. So we'll try and crisscross our way through the countryside over here and then see how we can connect these two to the line at some point. Anyway, um, tell me what you think. Where do you think we should go to um, from here? If we look at this here, these are our options. Um, directly um, in front of us here but uh, but some of them are obviously a little bit more difficult this is too close I think that is a little bit too of a too much of a curve to be able to get over there so we really need to um, head for Dartmouth um, need a market or Molden over here as the next uh, point in our in our main line I mean even these two are pretty close together to be honest okay now let me uh, quickly grab our lines and see what are we doing on our main line so the main line passengers do, 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 where is it we're after the train lines the main line for passengers um, sand kelp crossing over there so basically from here we need to go ahead and say guys we're going to add a station up here which is this one there we go and then on your way back you're going to stop at um sun cup crossing again but i prefer you to stop on the other side now did i i didn't do that properly oh i did do that properly so there we go so now there's an additional stop on the line there that we uh, can go ahead and get to I do want to set up a, a bus hub over here okay so we'll get some bus bus lines running out um, over here um, we'll we'll rename this town over here um, do, do, do. this will be a basically a road access town so this will be like Winters town and what will we what will we what will we do that if um, FEN I like it FEN like that 
fen um and we will get some buses to connect over there so let's quickly set up the buses to do, do, do where i want the buses nice and central so if i have to get rid of something in the center of town here i will do that even though yeah anyway let's pause the game if we want to do that so let's uh let's grab the actual bus thingy do we have a, a fancy bus building that we can use here uh I was thinking maybe this one, try this one again. Uh, do, 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 as, a, as a bit of a turnaround now, I don't think, I don't think so. Let's just, just, just do the standard, the standard one and we can kind of expand it any way, any way we would see fit. Uh, it actually, it squeezes pretty nicely in there with only needing to get rid of one single building. So let's do that. That's going to be the bus station in there. I'll go ahead and um, configure that a little bit bigger. We'll do something like that. And that's going to be fine. It's just going to be in and out over here. Nothing more so than this. Do we do cargo here? Is my question. But cargo will have to do... Hmm. Let's do that. Let's uh, add cargo in here also. Now, maybe we don't need to do any anything crazier than this. Uh, though we don't have, we only have now the one cargo platform over here. So if I wanted to add additional cargo platforms, that'll be another building removed or another building removed on that side. They're all pretty pricey. We can't just extend it because that won't give us an extra platform. Um, yeah, let's just do it on this side. Let's just do... Uh, actually, let's just do the one and see uh, as long as we uh, we go with that. So there we go. So now we've got a bus station over there. We already have a bus station over here. So all I need to do is maybe get an, uh, a route uh, in place over here. So this is going to be from Fuentes Town Exchange to, 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 to what is this one called? San Cal Crossing Central. Yeah, that sounds pretty reasonable. Do we not have a road connection there? Oh, it's trains. Okay, okay, okay hang on. It's not going to be train. Let's uh, let's just do a new bus line. Sorry about that. We'll do similarly. We'll do over there and we'll come in over here. Yeah, there we go. That's the route. We may look into uh, into upgrading that a little bit. So this is going to be road. Okay, from um, FEN to van passengers right there we go okay and we'll see how we how we deal with that in terms of how much we need and and so on so what are we going to grab in here let's grab some vehicles um longer distance buses 50 kilometers an hour i think is about the right one for us so we'll grab some of these guys the um the sorer tusher sorer tusher over there i have no idea how you, how you say that um, how many buses are gonna gonna take on this route? Let's uh, let's put like eight of them on there. Ten. Let's put ten of them on on the route. Do we? Yeah, that's fine. Let's just do that. We'll buy like ten of them, put them on the route there, and we will assign them to our Finn van um, line. There we go. So now we'll actually see um, some bus transport from this town over here into uh, into San Cal Crossing over there. That's excellent. Um, unpause the game so that we can uh, can make some progress over here. Excellent. So there goes our buses to pick up people, run them through. It's going to get pretty... Oh, it's auto-saving. I was just thinking, Ooh, are we uh, stuck for some reason? No. Uh, no, we're not. Okay, so excellent. There that goes. We've got the train running up there. So let's quickly have a look. If we have a look at the main line, main line, train line, what are we what are we saying um if i if i look at this right now we've got a train every seven minutes and i'm, I'm not too fond of it and i'm kind of contemplating should we get something some other trains on here but at the very least we need more trains on it so let's uh, let's have a quick look at what trains do we have available do we have elect fast electric trains available 100 kilometers an hour is the best we can do from a diesel perspective we've got nothing Steam, we can do these, but I'm still I'm still digging the Flying Scotsmans. They run to about 1975. So actually, the Flying Scotsmans aren't, Scotsmans aren't that bad. So let's just grab that line. We'll uh, we'll manage the vehicles and we'll duplicate like two of them or something. 
so we get a little bit more from them um, so if I manage this line and we say manage the vehicles on the line and what I'll do is I'm just gonna go ahead and say well guys let's uh, let's just clone these selected vehicles over there uh, and that should um, increase our rate a little bit more okay now that should get some stuff going do we have we don't have any local local transport happening here yet wow look at that excellent um so this town over here that seems to be like a very natural little little road for us to we can do a nice little little route through here let's grab another piece of road standard street kind of thing and we'll just try and connect it up over there uh, or what we'll do is we'll do something like this and then we'll we'll get the curve in there and we'll tie that up there oh man that's that's beautiful beautiful stuff right there so that can run so we can actually run through around either one of these and we can do a similar thing over there but i think a nice tram road up here up and down this road here would be good so let's uh, let's upgrade that and say electric tram go for it so we'll do tram up this main road here uh, what we'll do is we'll move it a little bit to the side okay and what we could also do is we could run one through there and so maybe we can do a multiple routes kind of thing okay that's fine let's get the buildings in place so if we're saying so if we do one loop like this and one loop like that and then they'll both run in the middle here i like that so let's do um let's do like a stop up here we'll do a stop over there somewhere and then we'll do the other side of these these will be stops there and maybe there and then we'll maybe squeeze in another one on this side then for this one we'll do stops on the opposite sides of this road like so we will need to get it to go to a, a central like stop over here somewhere uh, which might be so for this guy there and for that guy there yeah actually that i like i like that idea so i'll have a stop over there but we'll also have a stop over here for the two lines yeah i like it so it's not going to be anything different than this okay good then we'll have a stop up here we'll have a stop over there and there's no need for a stop uh, in front of this so let's just do it over there i think that's going to be okay so now we can get some roots in there what uh, and i think that's everything so let's just get our buildings actually sort out get our tram a tram depot somewhere so i'm thinking somewhere over here we have a little bit of space let's just um squeeze that in a little so let's do something like that we'll get some trams we need to get these routes in place so we'll go about our business by saying there there oh man again i'm on the wrong stuff let's do trams light rail light rail what tram what no idea what i've been calling these things i think light rail is the one that i'm after um anyway there 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 here here and there there we go so this will be light rail and what is this town epic epic eve eve local one or actually local and then this will be p1 there we go uh, and another one is going to be there 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 down here down there and there we go and this will be light rail um eve local p2 there we go and now we just need to put a few trams on these so let's buy some vehicles i'm thinking four on each four on to eve local p1 then we buy four more of them and they go to eve local b2 nice so there we go running um the eve local lines um we've got the the passenger trains coming in i'm not sure there's anybody coming actually jumping off here are they wow actually a few people 
um, jumping off. So Epicville over here will uh, will see some some action in terms of passenger movement now. I think we still need to work on how we're actually going to get freight connected. The other thing that we can, so this one is connected up here. So maybe one that would work for the airlift could be this one. So let's, uh, let's think about that for a second. What can we actually do over here? We can airlift some of these goods in so that there's something that actually gets lifted out on the cargo planes. That is that is a that is a, a, a good thing. So let's uh, let's build an airport out here. What is this? It's a cargo airfield, a cargo passenger airfield. So I'll just build, um, and we don't want it right. Well, we do want it pretty much um, on top of town here, and we can actually get it quite nicely um, in town. So if we do something like that, we'll have the airport right here. Um, actually, but before we do that, let's uh, this this will be called. <clears throat> Berlin and it'll have a code of BER and uh, and that's where uh, where the airlift will take place so actually we're, we're getting a, a little bit of uh, a little bit of a spot ready for that so let's build the airport um, over here these guys needs to connect somewhere else so yeah Berlin won't uh, won't actually connect over there but I do like um, it's it's fairly isolated over here and what I'm thinking we can do um, I'm kind of thinking we need to disconnect some of these things. But anyway, that's that's fine. Uh, that's fine for now. Let's just find the spots that we're going to use here. So let's get a little bit of streets um, kind of all sorted out here. So let's just go with some straight streets through here. Now let's just keep whatever we have. Um, something like this. I'm going to try and run that up there a little bit. So we'll provide a little bit of a, yeah, a nicer spot here and then from here I do want us to allow tons of stuff it's not going to be the greatest uh, residential experience over here but let's grab grab that in here so what's the other one then anyway we'll do passengers and cargo but I think predominantly we'll do dub 2 2 I think uh, and we don't necessarily need ah because this is the airlift we don't need the um, the depot in here so let's uh, move that in there. It's going to be a pretty horrific, um, horrific spot there. Okay, so what I'll do, if we do it this way, are we, are we kind of cutting into stuff here? Yeah, let's just do that. Ooh, we've got a new vehicle, 125 RE44. I think that's the mainline, uh, mainline alternative there. Yeah, let's uh, let's squeeze it in there. I like that. Is that uh, clawing into the mountainside there? Not really. It's a little bit of a, a little bit of a change to the area here. So here we go. We've got our Berlin airport here, um, and that'll be where the um, where everything happens. So let's uh, get rid of get rid of that guy. We'll make sure to add an additional passenger terminal. And then it's going to be cargo terminals, three of them, right? To make sure that we can get everything in and out as we need. Good. That is excellent. So the airlift will, will start happening. It is going to start with passengers. Uh, we'll see if we can get around to doing something else on there also. How's this uh, station doing? How's our money doing? Are we? How, um, how's our performance in terms of cash? Charts, um, income versus expenditure. We're only making marginal. Well, these are fairly high millions numbers that we're seeing over here. Charts. What's the? Ooh, look at this. Look at this. I like that. What is? What is this? This is our value. Our company value is moving up substantially, and our bank balance too. Um, our tracks, high-speed tunnel, total bridges, and electric. So all of that is kind of moving up uh, very nicely. Also, what's going on with our headquarters? Company score is twenty-nine. We'll have to have a look at how our headquarters looks. But anyway, that's fine. Let's not get distracted too much. We need a, a few bits and pieces over here. I am thinking we'll do th a, tra a little tram loop here. Uh, let's get let's get this uh, street connection. Street connection straight through there. Yeah, costing us money. I know, I know. These are tying up nicely. Little, little gritty, I think. Little gritty. Um, and we'll get a little tram track running this way. So let's go and say electric tram 
all the way through around uh, oops that's not what I want can we undo that so there we go that little loop um, over there then uh, we do see some buildings um, I definitely want us to get one of these electric length let's get a long one 30 20 is better turn it in this way so I'll have that one there and then I want the uh, the truck one um, over there 20 as well actually we'll get this one up here actually let's make this one 30 and then what we'll do is we will because this is going to be more stuff electric I don't know if, whether we needed that to be electric but anyway um, if I go in here I'm going to configure it and I'm going to say oh let's go street um, street access please full-on street access over there nice let's do that perfect now that's all set up we need um, a tram and a uh, Let's get a tram, tram thingy, a tram depot and a road depot. So we'll get a tram depot out over here where we've now provided a little bit of tram track that won't actually be necessary if we don't put it here. So we'll do, oops, that's not what I had in mind, but anyway, that's okay. The other one that we're going to grab is the road depot, which I think I'm just going to squeeze in um, up here. Well, let's squeeze it on this side then. Something like that. So now we've got a road depot over there. So now we can start moving some stuff in and around here. So let's start off by getting our, our oops, again with the wrong kind of stuff there. Um, now let's just start off with, with these guys. So we've got some stations over there. I am... we'll do some stuff here we'll do some stuff here i'll move it up there somewhere we'll get a, a bit of a station around this corner here get one nice in the center of town here and then that's going to be our our two loops there so let's grab our new line for trams it'll be there 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 and there and this will be called light rail ber ber um, local p uh, actually p1 and then we'll do the other one which will be let's do it from here again there 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 and there and this one will be light rail BR local P2. Perfect. Let's get some trams out on there. Dun -dun -dun. Let's just do four per direction. Go and BER local P1. And then four. And that'll be BER local P2. There we go. So now that's in place. Now what we can do is now we can actually start running um, some, uh, some passenger planes. I'm going to immediately do two lines, one to Chaos Grad and one to Van. So we'll have a slightly longer distance line here um, for passengers so that you can get into various parts of, of town. Uh, we don't want to configure it. We want to actually set up some lines. So let's um, actually it's lines. Um, plane lines and we'll say this one will be a passenger line to to guys grad Ooh, I don't like the fact that we're um, looping over are we looping over town Oof. we are looping over town can we can we Ooh. is there a way we can we can not do that uh, can we can we not run it on the other side how, how do we is, is there a way? I don't think there's a way, is there? There must be. I'm sure. What I want to do is, okay, let's uh, let's uh, start it over here then. Let's say we'll add you here and then we'll go there and it is going to do exactly the same. Can we adjust the approach or anything? 
Anyway, I don't think we can we can do much about it. So this one is going to be the A, um, and this is going to be um, CGD CG CGD to to um, um, what is that called? That is called Berlin, <laughs> and this is going to be the passenger line. There we go. Now the other one we want to set up is another new line, please, and this one will be from. And we'll start it off over here because we don't have a, a thing on that sign. So let's just get it picked up over here. Van to Berlin. Excellent. And this one will be the area line for van to BER passengers. Do -do. Excellent. Now. Let's go and buy a couple of vehicles. I'm just going to do the two over here. Probably need to sort that out a little bit. So what are we running here? Uh, the Douglas C49 Skytrain. What is our uh, 331, 150? Uh, we want to do passengers only. Wow, look at these little guys. Uh, DC4. DC4 is a good one. 15 passengers. Oh, the Skytrain is a cargo plane. <laughs> really? Is the Skytrain a, a cargo plane? It is all cargo. Nice. Okay, well, passengers. DC-4s, are we going to run DC-4s? Or oh, I think DC-3s and then longer distance to van the DC-4s. Right? Uh, these guys are doing all kinds of stuff. Uh, 330. What is this guy? 200 kilometers. I'm thinking DC-3s for this one. We'll do a couple of DC-3s here. Okay, and you guys will be running um, the CGD Berlin line and we probably need another terminal at some point. And then I'll go out down to van and we'll run the DC-4s on this line. So let's, uh, let's purchase ourselves a couple of DC-4s. Hang on, how many do we have? Multiple lines, why do we not have Oh, there is another line. It's just very uh, light. Okay, anyway, let's purchase a couple of DC-4s here. We'll buy those and they will run Van Berlin. There you go. Do the trick there, buddies. Look at these guys. Nice. Four props. I like it. I like it. So now the Berlin airlift is starting, but it's for passengers at the moment. We do need to make our way and get more freight to come into town over here. There's lots of people using the airport immediately. So that's pretty good. Okay. One of the other things that we needed to get some work done on was the the food cargo things. Oh, and I wanted to look at, okay, hang on. Let's let's look at the, uh, the new trains in here. There's so many things that we can do. Look at that. Up at 700 million, we're doing really well. If I wanted to buy a vehicle and we want to go electric, right? This is the new one. The RE44 at 125 is something that I like a lot. I like it a lot and I'm kind of contemplating should we um, should we change it up a little bit on the main line. Um, we should be able to, so that's 125 right, what was the um, steam on like? That's 120 and if we go to passenger wagons can we do 125? No, we can only do up to 120 with the BC4s over there so it won't make that much of a difference. Maybe we'll wait a little bit longer before we move over to that but it will help our our emissions a fair bit, I believe. These guys are running full capacity over here. Nice. Our main line is really um, pumping it out over there. Let's quickly go and have a look before we before we deal with the food. Let's. Over, I want to see what's happening at Kevinport over here uh, with our emissions. Are we reducing our emissions? Why are we? Oh, we're, it's auto saving, right? Um. These trams are electric, right? They should have reduced emissions. Even the ships, I mean, look at this. There's a fair bit of emissions going on over here. Look at Malushburg over here, or Malushburg over here. Lots of emissions running through here. So it's a little bit, oh, um, there's a little bit of emissions running up to that town. Um, Epicville over here, we'll see emissions from the main line. Uh, and maybe once we go electric, it'll be less of a problem. You should just put everything in a tunnel. Look at that, that helps quite a lot. Uh, obviously the airport over here is a bit of a disaster. These lines, oof, look at this, look at this. Lots of emissions, guys. 
Lots of emissions. Let's uh, let's close that out. Okay, now our Berlin airlift is is kind of starting its its way here. Oh, there's lots of people hanging out. A new tram, ATM four thousand forty kilometers an hour. Uh, Kyoskrad Berlin is a pretty busy line. Twenty six people wanting to get out over there. I like it. I like it. Okay. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Get, uh, don't get distracted again. Okay, let's see. So we've got, how many trains do we have running on this one? I think it's just the two. But the idea is that maybe we, we redo these lines now. So let's grab these trains. And I'm quite happy to manage this, these vehicles. And let's just sell off of both of them. There we go. Sell them off. Um, take the line. And, oh, line manager. So mug food. Let's um, let's go and grab mug food here. Oops, this one, tea mug food. We'll delete that one. Okay. Now, with lines deleted, I'm thinking we'll run one train this way, one train that one. So just one train there, maybe two trains on this one, and then a train that runs the food back and forth, maybe two of them also, but shorter trains. So let's uh, set up those lines. So first things first, the new line will be from here to there and back. It's as simple as that. It'll be a train line or track and it will be um, mug grain Oh, mug and it will be grain, grazen. It'll be grain. There we go. So there's the one. The next line is going to be from here to there is going to be it's going to be track and it's going to be mug which is going to keep the local name um, grain 2 okay and the next line is going to be from there and this one up to over here and this is going to be called Train um, mug la, 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 and it's going to be food. Okay, so now we should be able to move a fair bit more, but we will also need, I think, to uh, to maybe put another uh, depot in place over here. So let's grab a new depot. So mug will get its very own depot, and we'll kind of see about how we move this in. But I want to. I like uh, using a little bit more space so that we um, we're able to tie in more of this stuff. So anyway, we'll do something like that. I believe that should be just fine. And then what we'll do is we will tie it in um, over here as a starting point. We should be able to get it onto the onto the other lines also or something like that. But for now, this will little this will do just just fine. Okay, now we've got we need to run. I'm going to go with electric lines, the stronger guys. So if we, yeah, your E94 is a pretty good one. So let's grab this guy. This is going to run the grain. So the, the yellow will be the running of the grain. So we'll grab that one. We'll get our cargo wagons. That's going to work with grain. It's going to be these guys, right? These gondolas. And we can't get them any quicker than 80 Ks. Wow. Okay. Well, anyway, one, two. Oh no! Crap! Crap! That's not quite what I had in mind. Um, let's uh, let's let's just sell them off. Should still get a, a decent amount. I did, did the wrong did the wrong button, guys. Did the wrong button. Um, so we would like this to be no longer than two forty. But yeah, maybe that's a little too long. So let's do like 120 on each one of these, and we'll need um, we'll need like two of them. So we'll buy two of them. One will be going onto mug grain. The other one will be going onto mug grain two. Okay, so these guys will be moving. Now let's buy another one, and we'll double up as needed, of course. So we go with electric again this time around. This time around, it's going to be a green one. Oh, oh no, 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 that's not green. 
that's yellow. This is this will be a green one for the food line. So we'll add that one. Then we go to cargo and multiple units. Nice. Cargo is we need something for the food, which is going to be the box cars. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, and maybe we'll do 120 on this one as well, and then we'll just do two of them if we need to. We'll double up all of them. Okay, so we'll do that one, and this is going to be the food one. Food. Mug food. There we go. Run mug food, people. Okay, I'm hoping that will um, work a little bit better now. This one is dashing straight through. The other one should be whereabouts already at the end there. Oh, it's already picked up some stuff here. Anything uh, waiting to be picked up over here? There is a little bit waiting to be picked up. That is just perfect. Okay, we'll have to double up on some of these things if, if, that, if that is the case. Now, what we will need to do is we will now need to get a food line that's actually going to move food from um, Mug to, say, Chaos Grad as a starting point. 153 food per year. Is, uh, is what I, what chat or uh, what chat what comments tells me um, about these rates so if we do we need 153 tons of food over there so what I'm just going to do is we're going to say a uh, new line from here from Maluchburg sidings and we'll go um, into chaos grad the line is going to be track for um, mug to CGD if I can G CGD and this will be a food one uh, why is uh, why is there an issue okay we'll pause that over there what is the issue over here there's a train Ooh, show me show me show me show me why are you having a you shouldn't have a concern here okay unless there's something funny going on Oh, there's one line here that seems to have... Oh, you know what's wrong here? We need a, we need a, a thing. We need a switch. And I believe that should do the trick now if we do this again. Okay, perfect, that will, will now work. Okay, we're gonna see a little bit of food arriving. Yeah, I'm not sure because we don't have any bypasses around here, so there might be some waiting and things like that. Oh, it's already full, this one, that's awesome. But these, we're gonna run some empty trains here. Why? What? You can't pass through there? Why? Why is that one even on that side? Ah, you know what? We need another one over here. Okay, let's get another switch um, in place over there. And now I believe um, our lines should be running smoothly. Yeah, I think, I think that's fine. Now it'll work a little bit better, I believe. Let's hope. Let's hope it works better. Let's hope it works better. We would like to move a ton of food now. Um, okay, so now we've got... Uh, but this train will need to pick up uh, over here. So let's, uh, let's add a little bit of additional track so that it can get, uh, get in there. Auto saving is happening. We get a little bit of additional stuff going on over here. What? No one got elf? It's interesting. Are we seeing some food arriving? We're seeing some food arrive. Uh, okay. This one, let's just pause that. I just want to make sure that we're actually saying, uh, manage this line, please. I would like this line to go to, to that one.
Yeah, so let's just do two so that that at least means you're moving in deeper over here. Then the chaos grad line, let's just double check the chaos grad, my chaos grad food. You're going to come in at number three here, right? Or is it number, oh, actually. One. Oh, oh, you're going to come in at number one. You're going to come in there at number one. There we go. And then you will move, make your way through. Okay, that's perfect. So we'll do a bit of this. Okay, now let's, uh, let's get a train up and running for that. So we'll start moving some goods there. Cargo, electric please. Um, since we can't run it really quickly, I'm thinking maybe we just do one of these. Anyway, maybe the, uh, yeah, let's just do these ones that are a little bit better. So this is Chaos Grad food. We're gonna go with green, a greenish color yet again for the food piece. And now we need tons of these box cars. We need like 153. So if we're saying, 80 times two, that's gonna hit the, the mark and that'll be a nice short little train. And that should be enough um, for food to Chaos Grad. So we'll buy two of them, see if this even works. Uh, we need tons more trains, I think, on the other on the other lines. Mug Chaos Grad food. So now food will start will start flowing slowly, but I believe we're gonna need some more trains to move uh, move goods over here. Excellent. How much did you get here? 61. Slowly getting more of this going. Yeah, you need you need to move way more stuff, buddy. Where are all my trains? You just dropped off how much? There's a fair bit being stored here now. So consumption is starting to pick up. I would like us to see a little bit more. I think the demands is the thing that we were missing. So we are spending a little bit of money to get our, our food demand up a little bit. That's going to be just cool, I think. Nice. Okay. Um, hopefully Chaos Grad will start growing tremendously if we start feeding the people. Uh, hope so, at least. Look at that. What is this? These, these people have, uh, have little umbrellas on their balconies. Nice, nice, nice. <laughs> and how's our... Oh, I would like to see how our lines are doing. Our um, So if we go to... Actually, over here. Let's quickly have a quick run through here. All of our, all of our plane lines are profitable. I, and I love that. I love that all of our plane lines are in fact profitable. That is just awesome. So if we go and have a look at our balances, our new food lines are horrendous. Um, okay, let's see which is most profitable. Look at this main line, 20 million. That is awesome. Look, Van Berlin, uh, right up here with a, with a big ticket item train lines. Look at this main line fuel, doing tons of good. Main line construction materials, excellent. Really good. There's a lot of trains that's making big money for us. And I'm hoping our new food lines will, will also do the same. Guys, but I think that has been a long enough episode. Uh, we will start moving along. Ooh, I think this guy is actually starting to move some of these things over to um, on, on, on this, uh, on this chaos, uh, chaos Grad uh, food line. That's what I, what I believe it wants to do. Anyway, for the time being, we'll let it happen, uh, and then we'll see if we can uh, generate a little bit better demand. What's going on? Again, we've got, um, oh, better box cars. This is what I was waiting for. Ah, okay. What's going on over here? Let's just see where this issue is. You are running into problems. Oh, because we don't have a switch. Switches seems to be a problem all over the show. So we need, because we're not running long lines anymore, we just need to make sure that we are in fact running switches. I don't think we can squeeze a switch in here. Um, it's just it's just a little too too short to be able to squeeze the switch in. Uh, but what we could potentially do, and now could we do something like this? Maybe not at all. Does not want to. Um, yeah, that's this is a problem. I need to put the switch in here. Let's uh, let's let's try a little quickly something. Sort this out just a little bit. Uh, actually, hang on, because this is all the way here. I'm just thinking, can we? Let's do this. Uh, it'll slow the it'll slow the main line down quite a bit. 
Fine. Well, let's just get him out of the air first things first. We'll get him out and then we'll we'll put a new switch in. Well, that was actually a pretty smooth a pretty smooth transition over there. Let's just leave it like that for now and see how that works. Um, these are all okay. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching. As per usual, please tell us what you think. Um, how, how are we doing over here? Is this town of, is Fuentes Town starting to grow due to our, our bus line? How is our bus line actually doing? Um, are we profitable on this bus line at all? We are just about. Yeah, yeah, we are profitable on this line, but it seems to be just about. Okay, that's excellent. And yeah, all of the other stuff is, is, is still good. There's a lot that's happening. All of our new plane lines here are good. And there's tons of people waiting to pick up on some of these. We need more planes on CGD Berlin. Probably bigger planes also. Anyway, we will look at that as we go on. Guys, thank you so much. As per usual, please hit that like button if you've enjoyed it. See you next time. Uh, uh, enjoy the Discord. Join the Discord. See you next time. Bye-bye.